Hey guys, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter. This is your basic Sorgonomics. Yeah, it's back. We're still doing this. Just, you know, took a breather. Check out everything at Sorgatron.com and sign up for the newsletter and, and, and check it out on Facebook, YouTube, or sign us or check us out on your favorite podcatcher, iTunes, Stitcher, Spreaker, and, uh, uh, and, and let us know, you know, check it out. So you don't miss one or check the back catalog. It still applies. There's people. And by the way, thank you, everybody, uh, because I do have these in rotation to tweet out every once in a while because, you know, with all these episodes, I think just kind of you can still check into. Right. And uh, thank you, everybody, that's been sharing those. So uh, today I want to talk about Snapchats. I had two um, I had two goals because recently uh, and maybe I'll talk a little bit more about this. Uh, if you've been following me uh, uh, on social media, I went to Tennessee for uh, Baja SAE, uh, covered the event, part of uh, doing the podcast with them that we just started up. And um, which you can look up Baja uh, SAE Shop Talk on, on your podcast cast place and uh and, and check out what that's about but it's very specifically for this competition and i had a couple of uh personal social media goals um one was about um you know kind of a a, a, a kind of philosophy about how i wanted to respond to uh twitter and everything uh, you know over that course and uh that that's not what this is about but the other side is snapchat and again it's kind of the re-dive into snapchat which i seem to do every so often and and it is an expansion on my previous philosophy on it uh, uh, you know, it was one of those where I, I while I was certainly going to tweet and, and do all this stuff and, and, and play in so- social media on this trip because I got to visit Nashville. Um, I was a big boy and went on my first trip by myself on a plane, for instance. So a little bit of a nervous excitement there. That's how I cope is Twitter. Uh, but there's a lot of other weird little things that I do through the time. And I was like, well, this doesn't necessarily need to be a tweet that's a tweet that's flooding everybody and, it, and you know with all this stuff, especially as the events got going and the races and a lot of exciting stuff happened. Whoop, and I'm, I'm, I'm taking a lot of that on. Um, taking a lot of that in, actually, uh, in in media on my phone, um, Snapchat became the place for me to kind of unapologetically post. Is the thing um, where I don't necessarily strategize. It's just a place for me to go in and say, um, "Hey, this is what's going on," and and here's a here's a list of everything. And and as it is, it seemed like every time I snap and throw it to a story, um, I'm getting twenty to twenty five people checking it out it's all familiar faces you know of course but even going to twitter and say hey guys over here you know I, i'm doing this over here and i got a few new followers nothing real real big to to nothing real real big to to really write home about but still i'm kind of getting the vibe of it i hate that i don't have direct response other than somebody wanting to chat with me which really doesn't happen on the platform but again it was a place for me to take some videos check things out not flood people's timelines uh people that want to follow me and see what i'm doing and see the behind the scenes of what i'm doing on a video shoot or you know just bouncing around town and in, in, in a state i've never been in before um that was the place to be, and it's the place for me to play. It's the place for me to to experiment, and then and then as I've talked about in the past, that that workflow of oh that was a cool little video I just took. Let me download that. Let me throw it into Instagram or Twitter, and then everybody has a video to watch. And 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 again, you have kind of a first line of defense against that suck. Who cares? Nobody will see it in twenty four hours, anyways. And 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 being able to snag that, you know. Um, but uh, if you want to snap me at Sorgatron, I like the Twitter on the video if you're on that, or Sorgatron.com, and you guys can um, um, follow me on there and see what I've been doing with it. And so. So I did that for the four days of the competition, the extra two days before and after for travel. And, uh, and, and, and as I came home, I kind of carried it over. So, and I know this is going to be a phase. I know I'm probably going to burn out on this eventually. Maybe, maybe not actually. Uh, but I've been snapping everything. I've been just snapping my day, which is, you know, partially it's been, um, how exciting are the things I'm doing? I'm here at home working on something and the dog's here, or I go to work hard and I work on something there, or I'm, I end up kicking over to Mount Lebanon and going to the same coffee shop uh, because something has brought me over there because we're sharing a car and I have to go pick up my wife. So I just hang at the coffee shop over there uh, doing work, you know, or, hey, here's what I'm working on, on my computer screen. Yep, here's me in this elevator. Yes, I'm in Mount Lebanon again. I'm going to use that uh, geotag with the deer because I think it's funny. Uh, you know, and, and so that's kind of become... My voice, not that it's, 
I don't know if it's a particularly unique voice, and 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 I don't want to be just another guy that does a thing. You know, I don't want to be another guy that does this show, for instance. Uh, but uh, I want to do this show, and I want to, uh, you know, uh, uh, make my mark on that, uh, create on it, and and have fun with that. Uh, so that's carried over. Um, what does that turn into as far as what do I do with this for wrestling? What do I do this for this? I think it's it's something that fits into just me being me. It's a place that I can just be me. Well, you know, me being me is me being my brand, is me being a videographer, is me being uh, a coffee shop goer, is me being a pro wrestling fan, is is, is whatever, right? And um, it's a nice place, place. It's a nice scratch pad for things until uh, the opportunity or the idea arises that I get to go take that and say, hey, that thing that you want to accomplish, hey, that thing, that message you want to get out, this is the platform to do it. And Or this could just be a thing that's a fun thing that's an, on the side that actually gets my gears going, um, which just gets me um, um, excited that puts some energy into the next project. That's fine. That's absolutely fine. You can play on Snapchat. You're allowed to play. You're absolutely allowed to play without consequence. Uh, not without consequence, but, you know. Um, and that's where I'm doing that on Snapchat, and that's kind of my current philosophy, current thoughts on it. Let me know what you guys are doing on it. Um, are you trying to push people towards something, or is that the place? I feel like that's the place as we overquote Gary Vaynerchuk on here, the jab, 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 right hook. Those are the jabs. They're, I'm not trying to sell you on anything. I'm like, hey, this is what's going on. Hey, boom, 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 boom. Check this out. If you're really interested, keep following it, you know. And, um, you know, if you're whatever you're into, um, you know, hey, this is, I think WWE does a really good job of that and do the behind the scenes. It's a big, big behind the scenes play. So that's my thoughts, my recent thoughts on Snapchat, my recent use on Snapchat. Again, follow me, Sorgatron, on there, at Sorgatron on Twitter and all the other places. If it's a social media, there's probably an at Sorgatron, and it's probably me. Uh, say hi and that you heard about uh, the that platform or whatever or me from this show, and uh, we'll see you guys out there. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.